I, I thought the first half was fantastic. I mean, I think uh, we scored two great goals off of good buildup, good play. I think we had a majority of the possession. And so I think the guys were executing in those moments very well. And I think we could have, I would have preferred if we would have scored a, a third there just to really try and put icing on the cake. But, you know, I think we were throwing a lot of things at them and I thought we were rock solid defensively. I don't think they looked like they had a, a chance realistically in the first half. So I thought the first half was incredibly positive. We, we wanted to talk about getting more numbers in the box. I mean, we've been struggling to score, but we've been creating lots of chances. We just haven't either had the cross or the, the person on the end of it. And so, I mean, I thought that was a beautiful buildup. I think Charlie to continue his run, you know, unmarked into the box. And then I think for Cooper to find him in all that traffic, was it was a fantastic fantastic goal. So I think that's one of the better goals that we've scored this year from, from what we've been training and what we've been working on. I think that was another great training one thing. He got off the shoulder really well, gave himself a good chance with his first touch, and then was able to show his hips, you know, to the far post and do that nice, tidy near post finish. So, I mean, it was, it was great from Dallas to have that composure and see that vision and obviously for Luke to find him as well. So, no, I, I couldn't have been more pleased with, with the, per, the group in the first half today. These are things that we, we do talk about, we do remember. We still have guys on the team that when they, when they were very good and they schlacked us. And I think, you know, hopefully just how we play and our brand of soccer is showing that we can play with anybody. But you've always got to find that extra motivation, you know, especially we're right in kind of that mid-season slump area where you can turn off mentally and physically. And I think today it was more of a mental game than anything else. And so, you know, to keep going, keep attacking, keep doing what we've been doing, even though we haven't got the reward over the past couple games, I think shows great resilience from this group and you know hopefully we can continue this. I hope I'm hoping a win like this can help spark us to really get that that second level of energy, that second wave of of just belief that we need um, with now I think what six games left in the season. So um, this was definitely an important one. We've also talked about being very good at home. Right now we've been very good at home and so if we want to host a home playoff game or have a bye we've got to make sure that we take care of business at home. So I'm, I'm really pleased we did that today. It feels great. Um, ever since I got here as a freshman, Mace has definitely been a top contender in the RMAC, so it feels really good to get three points against them. And yeah, it feels really good for that for our program. Um, the past uh, against CSU Pueblo and UCS, we've been putting up good fights. Um, this year, I think we've had uh, one of the best teams. Um, we're able to move the ball around, we're all connected. Um, with uh, especially with our midfield, we're all we're all getting the ball, playing it together, center backs. So everyone's really just on the same page for the first time. Um, it feels really nice to be a real, like a, a good team. So I know it felt great. Um, we definitely just need one to put them away early, um, and for Charlie to get that goal, it means everything for the team. Uh, whenever Bone gets on the turn, I always want to start running forward. He makes plays happen. Uh, been a really great player for us this season. So and we're really uh, starting to to get onto the front foot. Um, I feel like the past two years I've been here, uh, we started off pretty slow in the conference, and right now we're taking it uh, head on. I thought, yeah, I thought the first half, we came in very strong. Obviously, we didn't have the result we won against Westminster, and I think we were a little bit bummed out about that, but we knew we had to kind of just like go on to the next game, and I thought I thought everybody did like good at really putting in all their effort and stuff. I think the second half, it's a little bit, a little bit rougher, but at the end, I mean, we still got the result we wanted, and. I think we just gotta like look forward and kind of have that same energy in the first half, like moving on. Uh, yeah, it felt great, honestly. I would like, I, I think in the, all the other games, I was, oh, I really wanted to score, but we couldn't really get like those shots off and stuff. And um, yeah, I was just glad I could get on the end of it. I saw Cooper right now in line, and I knew he has that speed and he could cut it down, and then I could get, just get a shot off from that. But um, yeah, it feels good, and hopefully we can get a lot more shots in the next few games. Cause I know. We've been having a little bit of a rough time in the other games, but I think today we we got the shots that we needed. So yeah, yeah. I mean, I feel good, but um, I think there's just way more that we can be doing. I think we can go to that next level. I think, yeah, I think we're playing good soccer, but we haven't got the results against some of those top teams. And um, if we just continue to keep working and like learning from those mistakes. Then like we'll have no problem playing against those top teams when it, when it comes back around. So yeah.